that this part here is kind of low. Now we're going to take the tie and make it go into the hole. I'm going to grab under, flip it around and push it through the hole. As I'm halfway through, I'm going to grab my pinky. It's not necessary. Just go ahead and pull the rest of it through. Again, now flipping it so the seam side is showing. Okay, see I didn't have that part. Take a good look at the knot here. Feel free to give a small tug on the tie at the end of every step. You don't want it too tight, but then again, not too loose. We're now going to take the tie and go across the hole. So take the tie, pull it over to the side, and then make it go across the hole. At this point, I have a good tip for you. Before you go across the hole, put your finger right here. Again, I'm going to place the tie on my shoulder just so you can see that the face is now showing. The next step is to take the tie and make it go out of the hole again. As we do that, we're going to kind of flip it. All right, bitch, hurry up. So take the tie and kind of just push your fingers around and through. Again, as you make the tie go out of the hole, you're going to flip it over. So again, the face is showing. In future, it's at this point you may want to switch hands but then you won't have the benefit of the tip I gave earlier. To finish, you're going to take the fat end of the tie and put it behind the across step. It's kind of hard to explain where that is, which is why I told you to put your finger there. So take the fat end and make it go right where your finger is. Again, I'm using nice. one hand here, but at this point, it can be easier to just grab the fat end with that one finger. Either way, you're going to pull the fat end through and keep pulling until the knot is tight. As you're pulling the knot tight, make sure not to lose the skinny end you can squeeze the bottom to help form the proper shape. Pulling the two tops apart will also help. To tighten the tie around your neck, there you grab go. the skinny end with one hand and the bottom of the knot with the other hand. And now you do a pull and slide motion. Pull on the skinny end, slide the knot. Pull, slide. Tidy up a bit, make sure everything looks nice. 